Your body is the best place to start for learning to live in the present moment, to sense and move with the flow of the cosmos. The responsiveness of your body to awareness is the key to transformative learning and change. When your body responds to awareness, this is called embodying mindfulness. Mindfulness takes you beyond your limitations. It takes you beyond the limited way in which you know yourself. It can also get you to discover and create a whole new reality for yourself. So what do you do to help you change your circumstances, to change your reality? Perhaps you're an anxious wreck, full of mental anguish most of the time. How can you free yourself from the pain of anxiety and move forward with a peace of mind? Well, Tai Chi awakens the self-sensing and self-renewing system that you are. It leads you to a self-discovery that you no longer are your pain. The art and practice of Tai Chi frees you to discover a new realm of possibility. And it starts with moving your body in a certain way. When you begin to learn Tai Chi, you immediately participate in the present. You begin the process of becoming in a way that heals and transforms. It starts with being open um, to the idea that you are bigger than your pain. And with practice, your pain and limitations disappear. With the slightest shift in your movements from hard to soft, from moving in angular fashion to being more rounded and fluid with your motions, you shift your awareness, bringing about profound change. And this is a very deep, profound change in your life. You're no longer living in the same body, the body that you lived with in pain. By practicing Tai Chi, you are making the most important change for your health and liberation. How? Well, here's a little secret. By using no effort or act of will, you're just simply moving the energy along. And Tai Chi is both practical and profound. It's practical in, a, in the way that you use your body to practice releasing and letting go. It's profound because Tai Chi is an invitation to being in deeper alignment with your innate intelligence. And what is this innate intelligence? It is called Qi. Qi brings about a self-sustainable new basis for living that functions from self-sensing and self-renewing. And the repetitive slow motions of Tai Chi generate energy and activate your body's innate intelligence, Qi. When the Qi flows, your body heals. It's about that simple. When you move your hands and feet, you're pumping energy, right? And you move energy and by doing so you generate more energy. So the slow movements bring focus back to your body and your mind resides in your body. When your mind and body join together, when your consciousness and subconsciousness join together, you activate your intelligence to renew your body and connect with the cosmos. So with this simple exercise of moving your hand up and down, right, in a circular fashion, as you do in some Tai Chi movements, and you follow the line of your spine up and down and move in a circular fashion, you pump energy up and down and you kind of do a body scan with your hands and start to sense and feel your fingers as they move from one end to the other end, right? Move your hands up and down, one in front of the other, in a circular manner. manner. And do this for a few minutes. So let's do some Tai Chi to let your energy move 
with the flow. All right, following our hand movements we just did, now we're going to use them in a posture called pheasant stands on one leg in the Tai Chi form. So relax, exhale into your left foot, then energize, stand on one leg. One step to the side, exhale, drop into your right foot, then energize, stand on the other leg. One step to the side, shift the weight and energize. One hand up, one hand down. Then one step to the side, exhale, drop and energize. One hand up, one hand down and relax. Exhale, shift the weight and energize. Pheasant stands on one leg. One step to the side, two exhale and three. Pheasant stands on the other leg. And you can do this for the next few minutes. Relax and energize. One step to the side, sit on your one foot and then energize, lift the leg up. One step to the side, exhale and energize. Pheasant stands on one leg. Exhale, relax, sink back down, energize. Pheasant stands on one leg. Then relax, exhale, and let yourself go. So what if you can sense your pain? I mean, really sense your pain and realize the pain is something that is not fixed and unchangeable. What if you can move your energy and make your pain go away? And what are these energy channels in your body that help you to move the energy, move the pain? We'll find out more by following me on Instagram.